Hey, Brad here from West Coast Mazda. We're here today in the all new 2014 Mazda 3. Compact cars offer practical A to B transportation, and a lot of cars uh, have tried to differentiate themselves by just dumping features into the car. Uh, Mazda's goal with the new Mazda 3 was to re engage the driver. Uh, everything in here is driver focused. For example, the heads up display here shows driver. It won't show you the text message you just received from your uh, friend. It won't show you what song is playing through the Bluetooth audio, but what it will show you is turn-by-turn -turn navigation instructions, your vehicle speed, alerts from some of the active safety uh, systems in the car. Anything uh, else it would be found over here on the large 7-inch screen. Things such as uh, any communication or entertainment options. The screen here is, as you can see, quite large. It's perched atop the, top of the, uh, the dash but it is uh, being designed that everything is really easy for the driver to read. Um, the fonts are of a good size, uh, where again, if you do take your eyes off the road, uh, nothing is going to distract uh, the driver. In designing the 2014 Mazda 3's interior, uh, Mazda designers uh, benchmarked it not against other compact cars that it competes against, but against the luxury mates. Uh, they benchmarked it against BMW, against Audi, and it really shows in here the fit and finish is uh, far superior to anything else in its class. Uh, a lot of the other uh, manufacturers have just recently redesigned their compact cars, and just sitting in one versus the other, you can tell that this is truly an alternative to a luxury vehicle and not just practical A to B transportation. And that really differentiates this car from other cars in its segment, which are just trying to sort of dump as many features as they can into a car for a certain price point. Uh, Mazda's really started from the ground up with this car, uh, strive to re-engage the, the driver. Everything on the seven inch screen here is accessible through this HMI controller. And although it's a touch screen, you'd be wise in using this HMI controller as it's incredibly intuitive and easy to use. We spend a lot of time in the Mazda world talking about just how well the cars drive and the 2014 Mazda 3 is absolutely no exception. No other uh, car drives like this car drives. But again, we spend a lot of our time here in the interior of the car and when you're spending, you know, $20,000, uh, you want to uh, feel like you're getting a good value for your money. Uh, I would challenge anybody that's in the market for a car to just sit in some of the competitive vehicles. Sit in an Audi, sit in a BMW, and then sit in this car. And the comparisons you'll make will be to those luxury brands and not to some of the other compact cars that this car competes with on a, a price point. I'm Brad Hansen here for West Coast Mazda. I challenge you to drive the competition and then drive the Mazda 3 and I'm confident that you're going to love your new 2014 Mazda 3.